Hello, wonderful, amazing video game type people, and welcome back to Massive Chalice. Let's go for Reach for the Stars 2. Always try to keep tabs on the traits and personalities of your vanguard. They make a difference. Alright. Wow, we do not seem to have quite as much to hide behind. So this may be slightly rougher. Alright, I guess we should start remembering what the different areas look like. So this is the Ashlands or something, I believe. Alright, Mr. Trick Shot. Uh, boom. Not too shabby. Let's see if we can't blow you up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whoa. Ah, should have done it to the other guy. Oh well. a misclick and a half. Oh well. Oh, there they come. Asthma attack. Oh good. That one fled. Alright, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Nice. Okay. the darn fella. Alright, how are we going to kill him? There's not much for us to lob things over. So, I'm really not too sure. But that doesn't mean I'm not going to try. Uh, that's kind of risky going that way. There's that explodey fella over there. Uh, I suppose everyone book it. I love that little jangle of the of the alchemist equipment. Alright. I think we can probably kill him this turn. Yeah, we'll be fine. Okay, we're gonna try that uh, follow-up shot. Oh yeah, that should Actually shoot that far? No. Um. Um. I suppose. Yeah, we can just kind of hang out here. that. Has he been getting hurt this whole time? 
I hope not. Okay. Listen up, Lydia. This is all you now. Not really, but... That gives us a chance to test out the, uh, the other thing, so that's kind of nice. Uh, the healing potion. Let's see, who wants to level up? Yeah, okay, Pais. Actually, is there a younger person among among this crowd? No, not really? Okay, well, Skeckle's younger, so... Uh, let's throw that... Uh, okay, don't throw the flask, that works too. Didn't really want you to throw it, I guess. over there, so... Uh, yeah, let's try that. You get to move there. And you get to heal yourself. Yay! Yeah, you can that. Did you just smash it on yourself? That was very aggressive for consuming a healing potion. But okay, I will not ask. There they go. Look at him. That fella sauce. That's no good. That's okay, we're gonna bombard them. <laughs> Dang asthmatics. Okay, so we've got one guy in here. Uh, those two over there. Okay, well. I wonder if moving there will do anything. No, not really. Okay. How about you, friend? Oh, yes. Okay. We're just gonna move you somewhere where you hopefully get a line of sight. Nope, no line of sight. Okay. That's fine. Well, that hit. Woo! Alright. Now we're shooting blind, friend. Alright. Can you, uh... Yeah, you can. Give it a go. What's up? Whack ton of damage. Good miss. Almost taking your fell out. That's okay. Oh, good. I was just gonna say, can't hurt to move there. Man, is it just me or are the enemies starting to get more and more numerous? All right, young at heart. Impressionable and young at heart. What, what does that mean? I, let's find out. A youthful outlook prevents the impact of age on stats. Oh, good. I like that. He's young at heart. Impressionable. Personality is strongly influenced by other heroes in combat. Oh, good. So everyone else around him is young. That's nifty, I guess. <laughs> uh, all right, let's let's give that a go. Nice. That was actually really cool. All right. Well. happily take a shot at this fell. What are the odds of, uh... Uh-huh. Okay, not too shabby. Now tell me that wasn't fun. Right, Lydia's the one I should be trying to level up. <laughs> Darn it, she had an asthma attack from running too much. I like that rock music coming in. Alright, Rock of the Age is over here. Everybody get into position. You can hang out safe there, I think. the 
devil is that bad guy? Aww. No, nothing still. Okay. Whoa! Found one! Can he come through there? I don't think he can. Okay. Well, we know where one is. We know there's another one up there. So let's send a little bit of back up this way. Yeah, maybe we'll spend some more. There's two of them. They're probably coming around. Oh, no, they're not. Okay. Well, if you're not going to come around, if you're going to go ahead and be done like that, then that's what you get. That guy is way too good. I hope he doesn't die anytime soon, even though he's probably going to die in a couple of years. Uh, what do we have over here? What are the odds that you can actually shoot at something? Okay, not very good. Got it. Um, can you... No. Okay, no throwing. That's cool. No big. Alright, well you go ahead and hang out with that lassie over there. Okay, well. Oh, come on. There's got to be more to the turn than just an asthma attack. Where the devil is he? Okay. Got it. Uh, maybe not so much. Shoot. Alright, I guess that kill's gonna have to go to you. Oh, shoot. You're out of flasks, are you? Then, bloody damn well book it. Damn. Alright, well, we'll book it anyways. Maybe you can get a kill. 81%? Good odds, I'll take it. Nice. Nobody had to lose any experience, so that's nice. That wasn't it. Oh. There's more of these fellas than I expected. Whoa, there's a second one. Impressionable and cocky. Oh, that's not good. You got cocky from somebody else. Okay, okay. Okay, we've got this. So we're gonna... Oof. <laughs> right, with the dude who can't actually do anything. Well, you know what? That at least lets us see him. So we know that moving there is a good life choice. Now... Wait, he didn't... He didn't die? How did he not die? I, didn't we get... Oh, that's just another fella that got bombed. Oh, that's lovely. Okay, get that kill. Or don't get the kill. Just kidding. I was totally just kidding. Wow. Okay. Uh, okay, Mr. Overbite. See if you can help us out with that. Yeah, do your follow-up. Man, I should have done the follow-up attack. Oh, but it wouldn't have mattered because it didn't hit the first time. I was worried for a little bit, but... Yeah, I'm not worried anymore. Look at this. What do we got? Uh, level, no level 4, though. Almost. And Lydia's off to a good start. The Sage Rites Guild and Crucible give great bonuses, but remember that you still need five strong heroes to battle the, uh... 
Oh, the bad guys. Alright. I wonder what happens if all three of those fill up. Also, I do wonder... Let's see, I want to test this. And see if I can... Come in. And rename a dude. Huh. Well, okay, I don't think I can rename Augustus just just like that. That's okay. Right, we're building a keep. How do things look like at the keep over here? Oh, we've got a bunch of heroes. Look at this. Just a bunch of brutalists. Well, it's good to know that we're going to get a new generation of heroes. A new keep has been completed. Marry heroes together to start a bloodline. Yeah, solid. Alright, one of our better heroes this time. Um... What happens if you... I wonder. I wonder what would happen if you if you married a trick shot. I wonder. Yeah, let's see. If I appoint Lydia Brockner, it would still just make trick shots. Oh, okay, they don't they don't double up. Uh, cancel. Yeah, there we go. Nice. I was wondering if maybe a trick shot and a something else would make a third tier unit, but no. Okay, we're gonna just leave it at that. Uh, hmm. I wonder if we could make two hunters, because the hunters seem pretty awesome. So you know, that's a thing. Oh, Sprock's a bit old there. Got that one level three skat kill. Okay, yeah, we could we could take Zhang. He's pretty awesome, so we'll take Zhang. Yeah. Nimble, impressionable, brainy, young at heart, Avenger. Pretty good. Yeah, Zhang is actually pretty awesome, so we're gonna appoint Zhang. A uh, high chance for children with Lydia. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> Is that the only... Lydia's the only girl in the party. Well, I guess that's that. We're gonna pass on asthmatism. Asthmatism? Is that a thing? We're passing that on. But we're gonna make hunters, so that's nice. Ooh, a little bit young, but okay. Are you sure you wish to marry Kevin Zhang and Lydia Brocknor? This choice is final and cannot be reverted. Okay, forever marriage. thing. House Shang. Um, build a Sage Right Skill. Yeah, Sage Right Skill is probably not a bad idea, all things considered. That'll help us research things faster. So we'll go ahead and do that. Uh, oh, we have to choose a region. Huh. An empty region. So I can't build it in the Keeped Lands. Not in the keep plans, eh? Okay, well. Um, this looks like as good a place as any. Are you sure you wish to build the Sage Rite Guild in this region? Yes. The sages will live in the desert. Alright, I just want to check. What are the ho House Shang? House Brocknor? House Academia? I like that one a lot. Okay. Baby! 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 So many babies. Oh my goodness. We've the got heirloom. something for you. I doubt it's something you'll expect. A lost piece of the chalice has been discovered. Augustus Pais recently learned that it's in the possession of a distant aunt in the salt stacks. But she refuses to part with it because it's the only thing she has left to remember her family by. 
However, she respects you a great deal, so when Augustus asked her to come to the capital today with the peace, she did so. What do you do? Wait her out. We'll get the peace when she passes away. She's had the peace for years. She must be attuned to the chalice then. Recruit her. Uh, oh, okay, that sounds... I like the idea of recruiting her. Uh, how old is she? D did, she did she say? Of a distant aunt. You know what? We need women, so... Yeah. Recruit her. Are you serious? She looks at you as if you're crazy. That's what you brought me here for? I'm a farmer. I don't know anything about fighting or attack patterns or the most efficient ways to dismember someone, nor do I care to. You'll have to find someone else. Ugh. <laughs> Why do I suck at those so much? Okay, Power, next time I'll just get this over with. try to talk Very her into it. Hmm. Attempting to drastically increase corruption in our lands. Pick a region to defend. Uh... Ooh. A newborn baby boy. A 24-year-old female alchemist. Yeah, sold. We need more young women. Alright, somebody give me women. Do we have any? We got... We got... One. Aha! Ingfried! Why did you have a boy? You guys suck. Ooh, a brut brutalist! A brutalist! Oh, this is very exciting. Okay, what does the Brutalist say? Uh-huh. Yeah, not very good dexterity, decent strength. Hardy. Cocky, that's okay. A lot of these fellas seem to be. Or, is this a lady? Um, yeah, show me your skills. A special melee strike that deals a second weaker slash if the first hit lands successfully. Okay, that's kind of neat. Yeah, and you can see the, uh, he's an alchemist there. So an alchemist fighter using the the thrower. Huh. So I guess he can still a brutalist is a good fighting alchemist, I guess. Extra item slot of fury. Increased damage for a few turns after each hit received. Yeah, that's that's just a brutalist seems pretty good. So House Academia is gonna be treating us well for a while here, I think. Yeah. Okay. Confirm. Uh, yeah, okay. We've got a Brutalist. We can't just have all Alchemists. Right. Faramon Brockner. Oh. Which one's better? Clumsy, dim-witted, and alert, or... Hawkeye, hardy, and alert. Yeah, we're going with, uh... Ravax, Ravax. Sorry, Faramond, but unfortunately you're dim-witted, and that that just don't do. What is what does dim-witted do? You're not gonna tell me. Okay. How do I? How would I find that out? If I click details, that's how. Okay. Lower intelligence, decreased dexterity. Huh. Yeah, I don't I don't much like that. So we're gonna go Ravax. Uh, we've got Ravax Brockner, Ingfried Academia, any of the older ones, um, Gary, 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 who could I replace you with, Gary, Faramond, and Ben, yeah, well, nearsighted and sickly but tranquil, yeah, okay. for Ben and Brad. Yeah, we'll leave we'll leave Skekil as the expert in the group. A level two brutalist. Oh, that's kind of exciting. Look at this. They're level two. Oh, even though they haven't fought yet, that's really cool. We're gonna replace you with the other young. I know they all suck, but dang it, they're young and they have futures ahead of them. They need to level up so that I can place them in keeps and whatnot as soon as people start dying here, which is going to be pretty soon. We're up against ruptures and lapses. Let's think about that. What do we have here? Two trick shots. Okay. Uh, two trick shots and an alchemist and two brutalists. I think that'll work. That should do. Yeah. 
Yeah, let's deploy them. Are you sure you wish to deploy with this vanguard? Yes. Into the chalice. The eyeball icon next to an enemy's HP flag indicates that your selected hero can see the target from the hovered location. One of your heroes looks a little queasy. Maybe tell them it'd be best not to eat right before a jump. And now there's a turkey leg floating in our bowl. Wait. This was a kind of intense start. Hmm. Look at that. Before I finish this episode, because I'm going to cut the episode here, I'm just going to take a look-see at some of these fellas. So, they do have the Brutalists. Oh yeah, look at that beautiful damage. What is the other, other Brutalist? Wow. Yeah, everyone's doing pretty high damage now. Brutalists with their 13 to 17 it is quite nice. And my understanding is that they're good at close combat also. Oh, maybe that's the close throw knockback flask? Oh, that's new. Toss a concussive flask that deals slightly less damage but knocks targets back. Interesting. Okay. So it really is a combination, and as much as a combination can be. Huh. Well, we'll see how the brutalists go. But uh, an army of brutalists isn't a bad replacement for the melee fighters for now, anyways. Okay, thanks so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time on Massive Chalice. Bye!